Hey everybody, grab yourself a Komi soda and stay a while because we are back with more Wind Waker. And so, uh, what's the, the, in the last episode, we, we did things on Outset Island, finished up what we could do there, and then we set sail for adventure. And now we're on a pirate ship and we are about to go to the Forsaken Fortress. What were you doing with Nico? Don't tell me you were playing some stupid game for treasure, were you? Well, whatever. There's something you need to see. Have a look over there. That's the cursed isle known as the Forsaken Fortress. There are all sorts of strange rumors about this place. What I do know is that long ago it used to be a hideout of no good, a no good group of pirates we used to compete with. But they were just small time. Now the place looks like it looks like it's pretty dangerous. Ah, I knew it. Look, over there, by that window. Have you ever seen so many seagulls flock like that before? I'll bet you anything that's the place where they've got your sister locked up. But it looks like the place is under really tight guard. This won't work. We've been we'd be spotted before we got anywhere near landing there. What do we do now? Don't struggle. If you really want to get into a dangerous place like that, this is the only way to do it. Trust me. I'm a doctor. We pirates do this all the time. Don't worry about it. It'll be a piece of cake. Is everybody ready? Never you fear, kid. We're pros. We're going to launch you good. Three. Two. One. Get a bowl! Or status. Wait, no? What? No. Oh, I feel a controller vibrating. We're gonna hit a wall. Ow. And there goes the sword. Down to the ground. Sliding down. Falling. And splash. Well, everybody. Welcome to the Forsaken Fortress. Our first... Uh, dungeon in the game even though it's not really a dungeon it's more of a fortress but it's still a dungeon and a dungeon we shall treat it as so moving on the quickest way to well uh, your sword landed all the way up there shoot I'm sorry I apologize I guess my aim was off by a little bit <laughs> the look on your face priceless <laughs> I slipped this stone into your pocket just before we fired you over there. It's no ordinary stone either. I can see what you're doing through this stone, and obviously you can hear me through it. So if you see A flashing, you better press that button. I've put the stone in your quest status screen. Press start and blah de blah de blah. Hey, but listen carefully. I need this back after you get your sister, so don't go losing it, you understand. <laughs> Welcome to the Navi of the game. Not quite as annoying as Navi, though, thankfully. So, yeah... We're going to go ahead and get moving, is what we're going to do. <laughs> Sorry about that. Stopped there for a second. The whole idea of this place is you don't want to get spotted. Because if you get spotted by those searchlights or an enemy or something, you're going to get thrown in jail. And getting thrown in jail just is not fun, so don't do it. Now, when you're about to get spotted, if by chance you are in that situation, if you drop the barrel quick enough, more likely than not, you will not get spotted, but otherwise, you're screwed. So, yeah. Basic rundown of what's going on with this place. <laughs> Alright, so the first thing we want to do in here is we are going to go to the right. There's nothing that could possibly catch you in this first hallway that we're going to go through, so, yeah. In here, however, we're going to have some mini blints. Screw them. We don't care. Go through the door. Grab the barrel. 
quickly. Because if you get spotted by these guys, you're screwed. See, there you go. I dropped quick enough, so I didn't get spotted. And now we play the waiting game. La 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 la. I'm not here. You can't see me. I'm in a barrel. It'll be across the room and you won't even realize that it's actually me moving. Because you're stupid. <laughs> okay, moving on. And yeah. Oh yeah, we're we are sleek. Duh, where did that barrel come from? Oh, it must have been there the whole time. I'll just ignore it now. So yeah. Get in here. And ironically enough, this is the jail cell room, but not the one that we usually end up in. So what you want to do here is there's a bunch of barrels over here. Get rid of getting rid of enough to get the switch, press it to open that door. And then you want to go in here and there's a chest. Are you ready for what's in this chest? I don't think you are. Yes, that's right, we got the first heart piece of the game. Collect four of these and you'll get a new heart container up in the top left corner of the screen. For each container, right, yada yada. You get four of those, you make a heart container. I've talked enough about this already. You get one at the end of every boss fight as well. It's a full heart container for those though. So, uh, let me take a minute to gather my thoughts here. Yeah, we pretty much got a ninja our way back across here. And then we're gonna go do some other things. Oh my, that was close. <laughs> that was scary, in fact. He definitely saw my legs, but he's just that stupid. So yeah. Moblin, get over here. Silly guy. I hear you oinking. Oh, crap. And you're about to find out what jail's like, guys. Because <laughs> I'm in it. Yeah. Alright, so, in the situation, if you get thrown in jail, get up on the table. And hop over here. Pick up the pot. Throw it at the wall so you can get the rupee. Crouch and oh my! There's a hole in here. Where does that lead? They so secretly held they so secretly hid it by a pot. They are geniuses, I swear. And take a right. And you end up out here. Beautiful, right? Yeah. Alright, so. Kinda conveniently, I guess, we end up up here where I believe this is the compass. Either the compass or the map. I think it's the compass, though. It is proving me wrong. The dungeon map. Um, basic stuff. Green areas are the ones you visited. The flashing area is where you are. And the black areas are places you have not gone yet. You press up on the D-pad to check out the map. And you can see everything from here. So, there you go. You now are a expert navigator. <laughs> All right, so let's just mm, fail. All right. Whoa, buddy. Hey, man. I don't like you creeping up on me like that. So please don't. Ah, I could have made it so easy if I just made that hop. Oh well. Conveniently enough, it was the jail room, so it worked out. Now we're gonna try not to get caught this time, so yeah. Here's hoping. Anyways. <clears throat> I... Ooh, piggy. You're trying to capture me. It ain't happening. Ha ha! And stop right there.
Get over here. Chuck the barrel. Get through the door. You finally made it out of jail. Better than me because... Oh my! That's right. Mini blend room. Mini blends. I hate mini blends. Everybody hates mini blends, I think. Nobody likes these little annoying jerks. So, we're gonna climb up here without any actual knowledge of what's up here because I am... Aw, oh, you suck. Oh, wow. I caught. Okay. Up here, there is a lantern. Jump for it. Catch it. Jump. Ha! Ah. This should be the compass. I believe it is. I hope it is. Crap, I hope it is. Because otherwise we got an issue. Yay, compass. Now you can see where things are hidden in the dungeon. Yeah. Press up on the map to see for yourself. Now, as you can see, there's one more chest way over there. But I don't know if we're going to go for that or not. I don't even know. Anyways, I believe if you take this door, first of all, you'll end up outside. Where outside is the question? Right here. How convenient. This is where we want to be. That is pointing us to where we want to go. So, first things first. Uh, yeah, just keep showing us crap. Sure. Okay. First thing, go up here. I hope. <laughs> yes, go up here. And then, no! It's flashing. I D G A F. Silly Navi. Okay, go over here. Grab this pot. Toss it. Oh, we have startled him. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Oh my. Grab a stick, and guess what? It's time to beat the crap out of him. But you actually want to swing it instead. Ha! 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 Okay. Um, yeah. That one's that one. And then... Conveniently enough, I think I can do this. Can I do this? Yep. No. I thought I could. There's a ladder over there. And... Ye no. Yeah, I just screwed up. But it's okay, we can get to that spot really easily again. The spotlights check over the stairs, so you want to be really careful. I believe we took out the primary one. Ye yes, we did. Which is great, because that pretty much assures us getting up here nice and safely. So yeah, okay. Alright. Alrighty then. We want to go over here, through the door. Knock, knock. Who's there? Comey! Mmm. And then we want to go through this door. Obviously. Maybe. Kinda. I don't know. We do. Though. That's the thing. No, thank you. Stop vibrating my hands. She has nothing of importance to say that I am not telling you already. I don't think I actually explained it, did I? You basically go and you want to find it where your way up to these spotlights and you want to take these sticks and you want to kill them. So that's about it. That will disable the spotlights and you will be able to move around safely. Bam! And he's dead. Alright, there's one more spotlight to take out which is over there. And we get to it from over there, I do believe. Yep. Hello. Yes. When I was a kid doing this, because I played it way back when it came out of crap. I don't even know how old I was. If it was, it's 2011 now and it came out in 2002. Yep. Don't miss it. Thank you. 
Um, let's see. That'd be nine years, meaning, wow, I, the first time I played this, I was ten. That's kind of amazing. Um. Okay, stop showing me things. I don't need to see that room over and over. Anyways, roll up here. And there's gonna be a ladder right here, so you can go up. Anyways, back when I played this w when I was a kid, when I was 10, um, I could not beat this place at all. I had so much trouble with it. Oh, oh there's the pot, okay. I had so much trouble with it, and the only way I got past it was because of a friend of mine who came over, and he was like my age now. And he got past it, and I just, I was completely amazed. Leave me alone! I'm trying to tell a story. Die! Die! Oh yeah, watch that roll. Give me your stick. Give me your stick. Oh my gosh, I wish you'd leave me alone. Please just drop it. No! Oh my gosh, you're giving me so much trouble right now. What the hell? Dude. 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 You know what? Oh my gosh! Jeez, I'm ha- Why am I having this kind of trouble? Damn you! Jeez. Okay. I couldn't get past it, is the whole point I'm trying to make. So, yeah. Okay, what do you want to say this time? Listen up, Comey, there's a m Oh, yeah. Shut up, shut up. I thought you were actually gonna say something important for once, but no. Shut up, shut up. I wish I could speed through these. I don't care about it. <laughs> okay. As I was saying, there should be a... Did I forget to do that? Did I? No, there was never a spot light up there in the first place. Okay. What do we want to do next? I'm trying to figure that out. What do we want to do next will be for the next episode, actually. So, um... I hope you enjoyed this episode, and in the next episode, we should be completing the Forsaken Fortress, at least this run of it. So, thank you for watching, and take it easy.